Hello everyone, Dr. Suresh here. In this video, we will be talking about cholesterol and lipoprotein metabolism. First, we will see the cholesterol metabolism. Before going into the cholesterol metabolism, we will see the basic details regarding the cholesterol. So, what is cholesterol? So, cholesterol is a steroid alcohol that present in exclusively in animal tissues. Right. As I said, as I am showing in the slide, it is widely distributed in animal tissues. Okay, it is absent in prokaryotes. In plants, cholesterol is absent, but other plant sterols, I mean, like such as uh, other than like uh, cholesterol, related to the cholesterol, those sterols will be present. In bacteria and plants, compounds similar to steroids exist, known as opioids, but not the exact cholesterol. Right. So the main thing you have to remember: cholesterol is present exclusively in eukaryotes such as in animal tissues but not in prokaryotes in place of especially in bacteria and in uh, some certain plants okay steroid compounds will be present and they are known as hoponoids right so what is the importance of cholesterol cholesterol is a structural component of all the cell membranes exist in the animals exist in animals especially cholesterol useful in maintaining the fluidity of the cell membrane right so, if there is no fluidity, the rigid structure will not allow the substance to go in and out of the, I mean, across the cell membrane, right. And what are all the functions? So, in separate slide, we will be discussing the overall functions of cholesterol. And so, these many important things are related to cholesterol, okay. Not only present in cell membrane, it is also useful in making of bile acids and also useful in making steroid hormones. It is also useful in making vitamin D. So, being in such a useful product, okay. And the synthesis and transportation storage has to be tightly regulated and it has to be meet the needs. Okay, meet the needs. So, there should be a complex series of transport, biosynthetic and regulatory mechanisms which will be involved. Right. And here to do all these things, liver is a center point. Liver plays major role in regulation of cholesterol at the same time it's the storage and transport functions. Okay, and especially liver has a major role in influx and efflux of cholesterol. I mean, taking of the cholesterol from peripheral tissues or the dietary cholesterol, or liver itself makes the cholesterol that is denosins of cholesterol, right? And efflux means based on the body demands and the needs, it has to supply the cholesterol, like maybe in the form of PLD it will be secreted, LDL it will be secreted, otherwise, free cholesterol it will dump into the bile acids. At the same time, the conversion of bile acids and salts and secreting into the bile. So, what is the clinical significance of cholesterol? The clinical significance of cholesterol, that means the efflux and influx has to be tightly be regulated. So, if there is imbalance in this, what happens? The cholesterol will start accumulating in the endothelial lining of the blood vessels and it's a life-threatening condition. Okay. So, the level of cholesterol in blood is related to the development of atherosclerosis and myocardial infractions when especially it started accumulating in the endothelial lining of cardiac arteries. And abnormality in cholesterol metabolism may lead to cardiovascular and cardiovascular diseases and heart attacks. So now we will discuss in detail about the functions of cholesterol. So what we said in the beginning, cholesterol is present in cell membranes and what for it is to maintain the fluidity of the membrane and is also useful in nerve conduction okay because it will be acting as insulating agent over the nerve fibers and it also making bile acids and bile salts and these are very very useful in uh, emulsification of lipid and uh, protein diet in the intestine and making of steroid hormones such as glucocorticoids, androgens, estrogens and etc and vitamin D3 from 70 hydrocholesterol and esterification the hydroxyl group of cholesterol is esterified a fatty acid to form cholesterol esters this esterification occurs in the body by transfer of PUFA, polyunsaturated fatty acid, moiety by lecithin cholesterol acyl transferase. And this esterification is must to reduce the free cholesterol content, I mean like free cholesterol content in the circulation or in the storage form. So you see here, so cholesterol, uh, how many compounds is having cholesterol? Cholesterol is a 27 carbon compound and it is known as cyclopentanoparhydrophenanthrene ring. Okay, and what is having in the structure? It is having four rings a b c d four rings in the structure okay you see here a b c d four rings in the structure to this what is happening eight carbon hydrocarbon chain has been attached to it okay and it is the rings a b c d all these four will be known as 
nucleus okay this is known as steroid nucleus okay and this is side chain 8 carbon side chain and it is having a hydroxyl group attached to the a ring at the third carbon c3 and it is having in the b rings between the c5 and c6 there is a double bond right and there is also a double bond there is also another compound at the eighth carbon so these are all the things about the structure and what are all the products are coming from cholesterol you can make out here 27 carbon compound Number of uh, carbon atoms in side chain 8. Importance is most important animal sterol. And bile acids will be having 24. 3 carbons less than cholesterol. And 5 carbons. Number of atoms in the side chain 5. And it is an emulsifying agent. Glucocorticoids and mineralocorticoids. These are the hormones. Okay. And which will be having 21 carbons in the structure. They influence metabolism as well as fluid and electrolyte balance. Testosterone and estrogen are sex hormones. Testosterone is having 19 carbons and estrogen having 18 carbons. So, testosterone is a male sex hormone and estrogen is a female sex hormone. So, that is the importance of cholesterol. So, we should be knowing how this cholesterol is synthesized and how it is utilized. Thanks for watching. Thank you.